But later on this evening, skies will clear quickly. The rain rolling through right now, just about half an hour ago. And currently, we're starting to see those storms really impact the metro area, as you can see from our radar and satellite picture. Some pockets of moderate to heavy rain, and the main threat will be some gusty winds here over the next hour or so, including downtown up to the north and east through Pena Boulevard and over I-76. We do have one strong and severe worn storm just to the southeast. That includes Hugo, just south of Lyman. That thunderstorm warning in effect until 545, producing some wind gusts up to 60 miles per hour and three quarter of an inch sized hail. Other alerts in effect are the heat advisory that's been in place all afternoon from Colorado Springs down through Trinidad, Springfield and Alamosa. We've seen over triple digit heat and that will linger until at least eight o'clock this evening. Highs today, we hit the upper 90s. It was a scorcher of an afternoon once again here across the plains, triple digits sterling out through Burlington, down and through Trinidad and 102 this afternoon in Grand Junction 80s for the majority of our mountain towns, but you hit 90 there in Eagle. Right now we're hovering in the 80s to low 90s across the plains from Highlands Ranch up through Keensburg, 60s and 70s into Colorado's high country. Scattered thunderstorm activity until at least 7 o'clock this evening, then partly cloudy skies by 9 at 84 and clearing by 11, 79 degrees by that point, so a warm evening ahead, but at least our overnight lows will fall to the 60s by morning. The sun will be shining early on, 40s and 50s and many of Colorado's mountain towns to begin the day. 60s across the plains early on, but it will warm up quickly once again for tomorrow. 50s from Steamboat Springs down through Aspen and Vale and starting off tomorrow morning in Grand Junction at 70 degrees. So for this evening, expect a storm or two over your neighborhood, but then it's going to be partly cloudy later on and by morning sun will be shining. 9 o'clock at 80 degrees, upper 80s by 11 o'clock. Tomorrow it will be warm, not as hot, but still slightly above average with highs in the low 90s by 2 p.m. That includes Boulder down into Highlands Ranch, up over the northeastern plains, upper 90s once again for tomorrow. And again, triple digit heat expected over the southeastern plains. 70s and 80s into many of our mountain towns. And as we take you through the rest of our future cast tonight, you can see all that storm and shower activity ending quickly. Early morning, it's going to be calm and clear. Temperatures will warm to the low 90s. Clouds increase and a pretty similar weather pattern for tomorrow. Another round of thunderstorms and showers possible first over higher terrain, including here in Denver. Chance for rain right around 6 o'clock and then across the eastern plains, a stronger storm or two possible. Overall, as we look ahead at our 10 day forecast in terms of temperatures and precipitation, slightly warmer and wetter than average, where we'll see 90s stick around through the weekend, along with that chance for afternoon thunderstorms. We'll keep you posted on any risks of severe weather, but for this evening that will end and skies will clear, but expect the 90s for the rest of the week, guys. Right. Thank Thanks, you, Katie. Katie.